I'm Peter Drury, and joining me here, our expert, Jim Beglin. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. And just joining us, we are already on the way. Who do you, Jim, see making a difference here? Yeah, Kevin De Bruyne. He's just one of the best strikers of the ball. Shoots! Oh, terrific run to latch onto it, but the finish is all wrong. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. Aguero takes control of it and he's on the move. Now it's Silva. And it's De Bruyne. Sinchenko. Breaks on here. Going through. Townsend. Looks to slip it through. Turns and goes back. Ward. He's got options in the box if he gets... Gets up to head it! He's delivered all right! There is the breakthrough! And however many surrounded him, that is what he can do. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Gundogan. Ake gets into the right position to intercept. And it's Aguero. And Bernardo Silva! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Or what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Milivojevic spreads it towards the left. Just ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. De Bruyne. Sterling. Played out to the wing. Aguero looking to get on the end of this. Hennessy claims it. And it's Aguero. Looks like a good... Bernardo Silva! What about it? Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, they're back on level terms, so the guessing game goes on. As to what will happen from here, I've no idea. Van Arnholt passes it through. Played into the middle. Just brushed off the ball there. The whistle goes for half-time. Genuinely interesting game here. Very, very watchable. Two goals, one each. It's been a decent 45 minutes. Competitive, certainly, and a goal each. Already up and running for the second half. Sterling. De Bruyne. 
Now it's Aguero. Patrick van Arnholt. So what's he planning here? Tries a through ball. Ederson deals with it effortlessly. Gundogan, and it's Aguero. It's come loose. Could move up a gear here. Now it's Benteke. Manchester City are keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Deftly done. Now it's Aguero. Room for a shot. Well played, he saw that coming. Now the pass. MacArthur. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. loose who's getting there here comes the corner massive leap decent clearance now can anyone get on the end of it look this can still go either way it might be flowing one way but there's still time for some ebb Josh Towns has a hit! Really well taken goal. And again they hit the front. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. Manchester City making consecutive changes here. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Crystal Palace take the lead. Well, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Cruising. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Manchester City have decided now is the time to make their final change. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Crystal Palace could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? <laughs> Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Crystal Palace emerge victorious here, and it's no more than they deserve. They were simply the better team. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Well, they approached this with a very definite game.